Hey guys, it's The Simmering Sims. So today we're back with episode two. I know it's been a very, very, very long time, but um, we're back with episode two of the Homeless Challenge. And honestly, it's I think it's been like two months and I basically don't really remember what happened. But um, the good thing is that we won't pick up where we left off. So let's see. I think I remember that I was trying to get her to marry Rich. And then she, but the problem is the homeless challenge, which is in right here. Let's check out this guy. He looks like he might be what we need. Let's start with, oh good. She's tired. She's actually really pretty. I didn't realize that, but now looking at her again, I realize how pretty she is. Although her outfit in this bar, I her out in, and this whole bar, this guy Ninja. looks the richest. Ah, so so. He's a so old, rich German guy. Alright. Come on, I said stargaze. Floyd Masharno? Oh, yo, yo. Alright, let's do this. We're gonna go stargaze. It's spring, so it's not too cold for her. Did he just leave? He just left. Ugh, okay. You know what? We don't need. She may be like bi, or she may. Women's sexuality is really fluid, so she might just go for a goth. And if you've been playing Sims for a long time, since the first game, you'll know who the goth family is. I don't think they're the rich ones, though. I remember that a dad who was like bald. Oh, Dag Dag. Oh. I've been playing Sims since the first. One where, so, so. um, when they had a baby, there would be like flowers and a uh, bassinet would just appear, and the baby's there. Oh, oh my God, my shoe! Alright, let's ask her to start this. We're gonna need that. That's Miko's grandma. To build the French hey, pizza. Oh, Alright, let's do this. Oh, Alright, let's do this. Come on, stop listening to me. How does she have nine dollars? Ah, I think she went fishing, that's why. Alright, come on, this guy's gotta stop this. It's it's really annoying. Alrighty. Alright, come on. Alright, they're gonna go start games. Let's see. They actually make a really sexy like couple. Don't you think so? Alright, it's building bit by bit right there. She's actually really pretty. They're both really pretty. Maybe just because it's my game, that's why. Alright, they're inspired. No, we need some romance. Come on. Okay, I think she's gonna get really tired soon. Wait, what's her, like, aspiration? Oh, she wants a soulmate. Okay. Yeah, she's getting tired. I'm thinking where I should have her sleep tonight. Maybe we should have her sleep. Oh, let's try to get... The goal is to try to get her to be invited to... What's her name? Um, Bella Goth's house before she gets too tired and then they could get in bed together. On the first day, let's do this. This friendship is building way too so slow. I turned off my cheats, and I almost forgot that I turned it off because I play with my cheats. And I wanted to just increase their uh, relationship, so that, that would be that. Okay, she is tired. Alright, let's see. That's enough with the start games. Let's see if we can make some romantic gestures here. And if it's gonna work. Sorry, my computer's lagging. Oh. Don't sleep just yet. Um, let's ask ah. if she's single, because if she's not, <laughs> then there's no point. Please be single, please be single. Bot and Grabby? <laughs> oh, yeah. Viva Jason. Oh, Viva right. Uh, uh, she's married. 
However, I know you can break up marriages, but because she's already homeless, I don't think she Maybe. has the time or the luxury to go break up a marriage. So we are moving on. Let's try this guy. Paolo. All right, you're useless to us, Bella. Come on, Paolo. Please do what we need. Please do what we need. I don't think, oh, I think I've done it once where I convinced, I got my sim to convince her boyfriend who was married to leave his wife. But it's very rare that you get that option just because <laughs> so, I don't think though. Sims like breaking, likes breaking up marriages. Uh, right. right. Stargate yeah, right. time. No the tip here no, is no, that no, 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 before you start making no, 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 romantic no, no, gestures, no, no, you always start these for like Shady five hours yes. so that they have a bit of friendship at least. And it's a really Can good way to build friendship without uh -huh. like making oh, yes. many interactions. So let's see. Come on. Can you just get to uh, it? Uh. Also, this is. How old is she? She's a young adult. So why is she married to Mortimer? Isn't Mortimer like really old? I guess that happens in real life too. Alright, come on. This guy doesn't look too rich, but. Ooh, this guy. Ooh. He does not look very rich, to be honest. Ooh, that guy behind us. Oh, well, this is her husband. This is Mortimer. He's not that old. And he's a fan. Okay. Alright, this guy. He looks like an Esteban. Like a cute little Esteban. Come on, what's your name? Brent. Hecking. Yeah, he doesn't sound too rich. Um, alright, let's go to the back and see while they work on this, see what, what our options are. Okay, these kind of beards need to go, this the one that this blind guy has. Is it my sim? Oh, she's not. Fatima. She's quite pretty. She looks like she would be rich since she's wearing like a whole ski suit. Alright, if that guy doesn't work out, we're coming for you. I think she's going to get way too tired soon, so I don't think the goal that we wanted to achieve. Let's just have her go knock on someone else's door and see if she can sleep there. Just based on the fact that she's quite a good looking person, I think others may let her sleep in their house. What would you do? Oh, this is a museum. Never mind. Okay. Well, actually, let's just make her go to the museum because there are, like, benches in the museum. I'm not wrong. Let's make her go to the museum with a bunch of people. Everyone, let's choose... You know what? We're going to keep working on Bella, like, as storyline B. And we're eventually going to make her leave. Baco. We tried Wolfgang, and I remember. Victor is rich. I know that for a fact. He lives in San Maishuno. And these two are married, Born and Clara. So let's go. The land grabs are rich, but most likely married. Pancakes doesn't sound rich, but I feel like we could just slowly work our way up. All right, let's just grab Paolo and Katrina Caliente. All right, we're back. Okay, let's continue to stargaze. Okay, everyone else is sleeping except for Paolo. This is Paolo, right? Alright, let's continue Stargaze until we cannot tolerate it anymore because we need we need someone to save you. Chloe Masharno? Let's see what her skills are. Uh -huh. yo, yo. Like what she can do. Eleanor. Oh. She's alluring, so I'm hope And she's a foodie. Like, can you imagine being homeless and being a foodie at the same time? That would be really hard. Alright, uh -huh. uh -huh. let's speed uh -huh. this up. Uh -huh. What? Did he just leave? Alright, you're gonna go to bed then. Where are you sleeping? There's plenty of benches. Alright, just go here.
nap. Where did she go? All right. Let's fast forward. Sleep, 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 sleep. I feel like most Sims YouTubers have um, a specific computer that they got for Sims, and that's why it doesn't lag that much. But, um, I wish I could have that, but I can't yet. But that would be awesome. But that would also make me be like way more addicted to Sims than I already am, and I am super addicted. Things that we wish could change in the next Sims is letting like it's on speed three and it's still going so slow you think it's going much faster come on all right let's have a little plan who is she going to go for first choice paolo second choice paolo is the first choice and in the back she's always gonna low-key go for um okay bella goth and that's her ultimate goal Goal. And then in the meantime, she's going to meet like a bunch of other guys or girls, but she fell in love with Bella. <gasps> Alright, let's... It's 6am. Do you think Bella's awake? No. So let's get a little bit more nap so that we could um, get a little bit more sleep before we have to go full on on finding a soulmate in her undies. Alright, she's up. And I think Bella's gonna be up too. Uh, so so. Wait, you know what I've never tried? Huh. I've never uh, tried um, inviting someone who's not from my house, from my lot, to Rink a the restaurant to, for a meal. Oh, Bob. Who ends up paying that? Just money. An Do I? Does my family end up paying, or does the other person end up paying, or is it like split? That's, she's really pretty. Let's just be friends with her too. So that we have one more house to go to. Oh. You know how amazing this would turn out if she, um, oh. she and Bella found love and then she convinced Bella to the leave Samba. Mortimer, was it? No. And Dad. then, <laughs> so. let's stargaze or cloud gaze or whatever. Flowers. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's my story. So how Hot and grabby? Be if she and Bella oh, fell yes. in love, and then she came with Bella mm -hmm. to be her husband, and then she and Bella got married, and then they adopted a bunch of really cute kids, and she kind of like would only adopt teenage kids. Okay, there's no teenage kids to adopt in Sims, but child oh. kids oh, and yeah, because she yeah. knows what it, what it feels like to be homeless and she knows that the child yeah. the children kids don't get adopted as easily that would be ideal and i don't think that oh. um <laughs> it's gonna be easily achieved actually it is really easily achievable yeah. but <laughs> That'd be a really boring storyline because I would be able to get to oh, it in by yeah. episode four. She would have oh, her children. Oh, with her. Okay. So let's play it a little bit slower and a little bit more juicy. All right, come on, let's speed this up. She's very hungry and she needs to use the restroom, oh, and we don't want her to embarrass herself in front of Bella. And why are you just standing there? Oh, Oh, okay, everyone's here for some reason. Everyone that I like supposedly invited last night decided uh, to come in the morning. So now I think we have a strong enough friendship to possibly try something. Stand up. 
perfect. Ah, oh, right. dag dag. Don't leave. Don't leave. Come on, the computer is taking a million years. All right, let's do a hip bump. Oh. Let's do. We need to be best friends before we can like, uh. start doing <laughs> romantic things to her. So let's oh, make nerve. jokes with her. Zombas. Um, inside joke. Narpa. Bazoo with the nipples. She's stunning. Bella is stunning. Oh. <laughs> Symphony frog. She's way too Sinner. little for Mortimer. That's why we need to save her. Mm -hmm. Let's get to know her mm -hmm. so we know what she likes in this life. Zuba tube. Love a zuby. <laughs> <laughs> Let's. What else can we do? Boy, uh, What if we asked her oh, to move yo, yo. in? Misty Prada. All right, let's try that. Yeah, okay, this is cheating. Is this cheating, uh, guys? If you're watching this and you know the homeless challenge yes. really well, is this cheating? So what I'm gonna do is move oh, yeah. her in, but also move her husband in. And then I get to control them both. And then the fact that I moved her, her and her husband in, I get all their money, which kind of just ends the whole entire homeless challenge. But, um, oh shit, there's way more than a husband. Okay, they're also not very rich. Uh, let me say I'm gonna have to take care of these people. She has a kid! Two kids! Oh, I remember this family. But they did not look like that in like Sims 2. What should I do, you guys? Should I just move her in and then make her divorce her husband and then now I have two homeless? Yeah, because I think if I move the entire family in here and I get this $45,000, that's just cheating because that's where the homeless challenge ends. So I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to move her and then I'm going to make her divorce her husband. And then now we just have two people who are homeless and two mouths to feed. But I'm going to make one of them go to work. Well, let's see. Right. Sorry, Cassandra and Alexander, but I just took your mother. Oh, you're the maid! Alright, she's Wait, starving. Son. Oh, she has a job. Okay, let's make her go to the job. Oh, I'm sorry. Go to work. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let's see what she does. She's. Okay, well, she did not. She's not making a lot of money. But so. it's fine, at least she has a job. Is that allowed as well? See, I don't remember the rules of the homeless challenge. So if I'm breaking any of it, please let me know. And I will not do that in the next episode. And I will try to undo it as much as I can. Oh, wait. No. Before you go to work, we're going to make you break up with your husband. So let's call your husband. And you guys are not having a like great relationship anyway. Look at that. Look at this. It's less than half. And look at this. Okay, let's ask him to come. Oh, I can't do it because she's not here. Bring her here. She's here now. All right, let's invite Mortimer Goth to come. What? Oh no, I think he's at work. All right, let's try from here. If she's at work, we'll just get her to go to work too. Yeah, I think he's at work. Alright, um, he's going to work then because we could use the extra cash. Alright, let's go back to you, Eleanor. Oh, you just won big time because she's under our control now. Is that like kidnapping? I feel like it's kind of like kidnapping in real life. Basically making her... Well, okay, this is getting complicated. 
Are we just going to use the restroom? I don't get it when Sims just stand there and they're like needing to pee so bad and there's a restroom right in front of them and they just don't go. And then they should just pee on themselves. There's a bar. We can get something to eat in there. Get something to drink. Let's try that. Oh, you know what would be so cool? New storyline, guys. If her and Bella found love and they're kind of like a couple, but they know that they're poor and they need money, so they both pretend to be straight or not straight, doesn't matter, and they pretend to be single and they try to get with other people and then they get them to move in and then they lock them in a room and then they kill them and they get all their money. Let's try that. That's going to be the new plan here. I hope it works. Hey guys, I'm sorry that ended so abruptly, but um, I'm definitely going to make sure that we're back on our schedule for every Saturday. The next episode of Homeless Challenge will be up, so stay tuned.